Hi everyone. So today I'm gonna give you guys an intro, an tutorial how to upload the LaTeX LaTeX source code to the general of hydrology. So because uh, this is the raw tool uh, in uh, the submission phase. So uh, here I, you guys need to log in into the editorial manager system and click on the incomplete submission being revised all right so here because i already tried to upload my attack swap to this system uh, a, a, a few times but not successful so i will try it now uh, again now so you guys need to click on edit revision so here we, we we go to this session all right so uh, basically uh, here is say that we need to upload uh, a, a few uh, pdf or document files uh, such as cover letter declaration of interest statement so because it is the route to we uh, we only need to submit the revision of uh, the the, uh, the cover letter because I changed uh, I changed the cover letter and uh, the highlights also the abstract and the manuscript so that's why I have to un uncheck on the box uh, after that we click on proceed to move to the next round Okay, we need to wait. Okay, so uh, here we need to upload all this file. This is the requirement file for uh, uh, this submission. So the first one is abstract, right? You can uh, use the document, uh, the doc file, and revision load. You also can use the doc, doc file. The highlights, also the doc file. Uh, revise menu script with the chain map. Uh, this is what I want to upload using the LaTeX so code, right? And revise menu script with no chain mark. Uh, this version, uh, this file is also the LaTeX so code. Uh, the credit, credit, author statement, and declaration of interest statement. We will use the document. So here is the other file that I have already uploaded you need to prepare this before uh, the uh, route so uh, there's a few notes here uh, okay so here is my latex so code for uh, the two files the clean revised paper and the marcus revised paper we need to upload to these two files and also we need to upload a, a file with the uh, extension ppl and clean revise dot ppl and market revise dot ppl also we need to upload the file with the text the bit text file right and the lv l class l article template dot uh, PSD. We need to upload uh, this six file and also all of the image file. We also need to upload them. Here's a note that uh, with all the uh, all of the image, you need to set it at a figure. Yeah, we need to choose it at a figure and uh, the text file. You see that we. Uh, for revised manuscript with uh, chain marker, we will have two files, the text and the PPL file right here. Also for the chain marker, we will have two, these two files. And the P file and the dot .bsd file or the template file of the L class. Then we can uh, assign it as 
uh, changed marker or no changed marker, that no problem. Okay, after that, you can click on proceed. And we will wait and build the PDF. I have tried to uh, upload uh, the latest show code a few times and uh, it get uh, it give me uh, the output suck, uh, suck at this one this is the first one uh, this is the second one uh, the third one here because I max I assign the files not that not correctly so that's why it will give me the output like this it did not be successfully so it is the output of the LaTeX, not the PDF of the la generated by the LaTeX, right? So, this is the first one I tried, and the second time I tried, uh, it gives me this, right? Also the same. So, I tried to further to see what happened here. You can search for the arrows. So, here you see. It give me the zit arrows. Yes, not found. The figure is not found, right? And other arrows like uh, the environment in the system, they don't have the graphic abstract uh, command. So we need to remove this command in our latex show code, right? And several uh, arrow. If you can uh, resolve all zit arrow. Uh, the LaTeX will build successfully like, like this okay okay we will we wait uh, one or two minutes for the system to build the PDF file 